What's up, everybody? This is Morgan Flowerchild of Flowerchild Productions Incorporated, and you are watching Amplified Exposure Live with Teresa B. Let's get it. Afternoon, Facebook. This is Teresa B coming to you live from Amplified Exposure Live. Today I have my lovely guest, Mr. Earl Billings. He is known most for being robbed on what's happening. And he came on today not just because he's a cool dude like that and he's willing to give me some time, but he also came on today because he likes me. So for all of you Rob fans out there, you can come on, ask him any questions, and let's get the show started. <laughs> hey, Mr. Billings, how you doing? All right, all right. I think you should tell your telephone people I am not the guy on Sanford and Son. They get a <laughs> up, but he's about 100 years older than I am. I, I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Weren't you on Sanford and Sutton? I'm not that old, no. <laughs> yeah, they do confuse it. I saw something on when I Googled you and I was looking up all your information, and there was something where they cross -refer referenced you for that show. Yeah. Getting them straight today. Okay, yeah. <laughs> What's up? So, where are you located? Are you in California? I'm in Los Angeles. I mean, actually, I'm in a suburb of Los Angeles. So. They call it Valley Village. I don't know. I got here. That's what they call it now. But uh, <laughs> it's not, it doesn't even matter anymore. Los Angeles is so spread out now. From here to San Diego and, and up north, it's one big huge city now. You know, it takes up a lot of it. I, I, I was watching those shows where people jump in their car and they drive, and then they, next thing you know, they're at their location in, in movies and stuff. It takes wow. hours to get places in New York. <laughs> you know, wow. LA. Yeah. A lot of traffic. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Because, because of the uh, corona, but that's mm -hmm. good. Yeah, yeah. So everybody wants to know because they they're familiar with your face and some of your roles that you've had over the years. Tell us how did it all begin? How did you start acting? I started acting in Cleveland, Ohio, um, <clears throat> when I was a youngster. Uh, we were about three blocks away from a place called Caramel House, Caramel Theater. And I was riding my uh, tricycle in the parking lot. And a lady came out the door and said, she said, little boy, come here. And her name was Ann Flagg. And she taught children's theater. And she just picked me up the parking lot. 